Hey everybody, what's up? This is Rich. Uh, what I'm going to show you here is a lesser known function of Windows that you can do in Windows 2000, Windows XP, Windows Vista. Might be able to even do this in Windows 98, but I'm not sure about that. Uh, by default, you have a taskbar. Usually most people have that at the bottom. But did you know that you can have multiple application bars? I thought this was only something you could do in Linux. But evidently you can do it in Windows too, and I'll show you how to do it. The first thing I do is I right click the taskbar here and normally I have mine locked. If you see a check next to it you want to click it so it unchecks it. And uh, what happens you'll see this bar at the bottom where you can size it. Now what you'll also see is uh, perforations or what look like perforations. And uh, what we can do is that for any toolbar that we have in here we can take it out and put it wherever we want on the screen. I'll show you what I mean. If I right click this, click toolbars and do quick launch, we have a bunch of quick launch icons. Now what I can do is check this out. I can take this so that my mouse cursor turns into an arrow, click, drag outside, let go. And here is the quick launch. Now what we can do at this point is we can drag this on the left, on the right, or on the top. So what I'm going to do is drag this all the way to the top and let go. And then I'm going to resize it. Actually, before I do that, I'm going to right click this and do view large icons. And then I'm going to size it up. And that's it. Unfortunately, it does not follow the theme. So I have the zoom theme, excuse me, zoom theme, which is why things are black and orange here. But still, it's pretty cool to have. Now, if I want to do something else, uh, let's say toolbars, uh, links, like if, uh, that's in the Internet Explorer web browser. I can take drag that out and I'll put that one on the left. You can have as many of these as you want, which is great. And if I want to get rid of it, I'll just right click and left click close toolbar. It's going to give me a confirmation. Notice I hit OK. Now there's another way of doing this. Uh, it's a little tricky, but it can be done. Let me just close this first. What you can do is that you can actually take any folder that is on the desktop and make it into a toolbar. For example, I have one here with a whole bunch of mp3 files in it. So if I take this, left click, drag up to the top, real tippy top, bam, turns it into a toolbar. And then I can right click this and hide the text, hide the title, view large icons, and this is all the contents of that folder. Uh, if I right click, and also if it goes beyond, you can click on the right side and it'll show all the other stuff too. But I'll right click, and uh, also when you right click, you can just open the folder directly, which is pretty cool. And but what I'm going to do is close this and say yes. Now, if I have a blank folder, you can do this too. I'll right click on the desktop, left click new, left click folder, and call it test folder. And I'll do the same thing I did before. I'll click and drag up to the top, top let go and here we have a test folder. Now what I can do from here uh, I can drag things into it. For example if I right click the start button open all users and you have all your applications here, your programs and so on. I'm going to for example take uh, Steam. Here's a Steam shortcut. I can right click this, drag it into this toolbar and let go and then left click copy here. And now I have the Steam shortcut in here. And I can right click this view large icon and kill the text and then size it up and then get rid of the title. And there we go. Or I can make them oops, little icons. I can do this any number of ways and I can create as many of these as I want, which is pretty fantastic. Um, contrary to belief, some people think this is a dock supposedly for Windows. No, it's not a dock. It's just a way to do a launcher of sorts because all the apps uh, if it were truly a dock it would show you if the application was running inside it but it doesn't we have the taskbar for that down here to show us what our applications are currently doing whether they're open or not and I'll left click this and close the toolbar and that's it so it's oh and by the way 
when uh, you have your uh, right click to start and open up all your programs, you can drag a bunch of shortcuts inside your test folder first before dragging it up to the top or vice versa. You can drag things in there afterwards and that is the way to do it. It's a very little known feature about Windows that's actually been around a really long time. So yes, you can have multiple application bars. Oh, actually, you know what? I'll show you one more thing here. We can put it, let's see if I can get this right, drag it down here. It's not the easiest thing in the world to do sometimes. There is a way to, there we go. Oh, I had it. <laughs> Hang on, let me try this again. Okay, you can have it so that it floats above the, uh, ah, yeah, I have to do, oh, there, you know why? Because I dragged it inside, that's why. There we go. You can have it so that it floats above the, um, the regular taskbar if you want to do that. Otherwise, it'll drag it inside the taskbar. So I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of that and get rid of that. Don't know whether this is particularly useful to people, but I just wanted to show it to you to say, yes, it can be done. Um, and oh, and I also forgot to mention that these are stackable. So if I do test folder, do that. And let me just drag this one to the left, make another one, drag this one underneath. It should be able to do it. Oh, maybe I can't, hold on a second. I had it. Yep, there we go. Now I have two of the same things stacked one on top of the other. Kind of takes a little bit of work to do it. I won't say it's the easiest thing to do in the world sometimes. It's just one of those features that if you didn't know about it, now you do. You can put some good use to it or not. Just a nifty little feature of Windows. Take it easy.